Hey YouTube, Kira Twig here, bringing you guys an update to my Yu-Gi-Oh! Trade Binder for September 2018. I uh, got a good lot of binders to give to you guys today for the uh, binder video, and I also figured it's time for an update with all the other trades pretty much uh, wrapping up from the last binder, plus with the addition of the collections I purchased and a whole new binder full of uh, Megatin stuff as well. I figured it was time for an update just to show you guys all the new stuff. So let's go ahead and get started, six binders in total. And start off with the Mega Tin uh, binder, just to show what's all left uh, from this. If you want to make an offer on any of the cards you see in any of the binders, just send me a message on Facebook, Instagram, email, or Skype. I'll have all the contact info uh, down below for you to follow if you want any problems. Uh, best way to reach me, if you have any questions about what any of the cards are in the binders, then you can comment down below and i'll get back to you but save uh, any trade offers you want to make uh to me for any of the cards that you see save them for you know instagram facebook uh skype or email just easier if it's kept private obviously you know i don't have other people commenting on our trades i can also sell cards i can do concealed cash or paypal whatever uh, is easier for you that uh, works for me as well and I can also do uh, Facebook cash as well. And usually with the uh, sales when I make them, those are pretty much always sent out the next day. If everything cleared, they're much faster also. Uh, then trades. But if you follow my rules and wants in the description below, we won't have any problems either when trading. Always just the easiest thing to do is if you just check down in the description below and you'll see you know, my rules for trading, what I'm looking for, and all the contact info and how to reach me, obviously. But mostly stuff from the Megatins, Shadows of Valhalla in uh, these binders, plus some of the uh, OTS pack stuff also uh, in these. That's it for the Monster Binder. And we'll move on to, we'll go through the uh, small one real quick, if you guys can see it. Uh, Harpies, Pet Dragon. We're right off the pile. So sorry if some of the cards are upside down. Uh, just when people are trading, obviously, at Locals, gets shuffled around and mixed up. But hopefully, you obviously see everything clear. But if not, just comment down below, you know, the time in the video, and I will get back to you on what that card is, and if it's still for trade also. Just a couple small ones in here as well. And then I've still got the two collection binders. I've stuffed some other cards from the Mega Tins, obviously, you can see uh, in here as well. But everything in these are for trade as well, except the Cyber Dragons. Still have to give those back to the person when I see them. But everything else is for trade. And everything is in mint condition, unless stated otherwise. I don't normally like to keep cards that are, you know, damaged and then trade them to people. Just uh, messier that way. If they know it's damaged, obviously. Um, then they have to, you know, just take it for word on how damaged it is, and if they get it and they don't like the card, obviously, then that just, you know, hurts them more in the end, uh, obviously. I think I might have said obviously three times in that entire sentence, but it's my bad there. But I always like doing trades, you know, and I always love to um, work trades out with people. Uh, builds up a trade uh, trust also between them, just so you can come back and trade later on. Uh, a lot of traders I've been trading with, you know, have been for years now, so very well trusted as well. Um, you can check out my Facebook group as well. We do a lot of trading in that group. Uh, ref list setup also, which I'll have the link for that group in the description as well. So be sure to check that out if you want to join and you're just looking for a, a good place to uh, trade with others. And we usually are, you know, pretty hard on the people that. Um, you know, scam people, and on top of that, just because you always follow the ref list when it comes to trading, and then um, you'll know who to trust and who not to, who's good to go for for a trade in the group. But going kind of out of order, the black binder has some of the more bigger stuff in it also, but like I said, I was just going straight down the pile, so sorry about that. But uh, with the pink binder, if there's, you know, no sleeve, there might be multiples, of the card behind it if you're looking for more than one so just uh, message me and ask and I'll let you know how many copies of that one card I have but other than that uh, simple enough we'll get through the binders and then we can get on to trading and usually I don't like to spend too too much time on one page uh, just because you can obviously pause the video if you miss the card but 
I take too, too long, and the video gets too long, and people just don't like the stall, obviously, uh, for how long it took just to see a couple cards. We've got some Kaiba collection here at the end still. And then lastly is the Black Binder, which I'm zoom in, sorry about that. Uh, has some of the bigger stuff as well. This is an original Boral Load. The one in the White Binder was a uh, Megatin one, so that's original. And once again, if you want to make a trade or offer on any of the cards that you see, just send me a message on Facebook, Skype, Instagram, or email. All the contact information will be down below for you to reach me, and we can work out some trades. Like I said before. Fusions on these pages, the white spot, the blank spots. I really do need to reorganize the binders. Hoping to be down to two uh, within the next video at least. I don't really feel the need to carry around six binders. It just gets... So, you know, you're responsible if I lose one, that's my own fault, just because I had too many to keep track of. Uh, spells on these pages. Quill pens. Uh, some other ones. Secret rare ancient rules. Traps. And monsters, starting on these pages. Gale Dogra. These are super black metal dragons. Gravekeeper Nobleman. There was a Super Kaiko on the previous page as well. Kojama Blues are rare. Gravekeeper Recruiter is rare. Super Apex Avions. And a few of the entity cards on the final page. And that's it. So once again, if you guys saw anything and you want to work out a trade, just send me a message and we'll work something out. Hope you guys enjoyed. And Kira Twig out.